Hey guys, this is Dan, Sam, Emily, and Henry from huh? Fisher Jeep Adventures. And uh, I told you, I'm a mountain man. Get me out of the desert. <laughs> <laughs> on, our, on our way to the geyser, we decided to take uh, Rainbow Terrace uh, Trail. So um, if this is something you're interested in, uh, please stick around for the video. <laughs> All right, we left uh, Hell's Roar and Canyon and started headed back um, up to, uh, I guess, our final point uh, for the day, which is supposed to be uh, the Crystal Geyser Trail. On the way, after checking the map, we decided to head to um, Rainbow Terrace Trail, which takes us by um, a bunch of uh, rainbow streaked rocks, uh, which is kind of what we're headed to right now. Um, there is some steep ledges and that you have to kind of climb through, uh, but it seemed like a pretty good uh, path to take uh, to get us where we needed to go. We had been on just some basic trails for most of the day, so it was interesting to try and uh, see some new stuff. All right, as we came to this section of the trail, we start to see um, some white markings and they, they're little arrows that help kind of mark the path uh, as you go through things. And so the trail gets kind of uh, really windy. 
in here once you get past the rainbow rocks and uh, we get really close to a ledge here in a little bit uh, that we had to kind of uh, negotiate in a different way but if it wasn't for the white marks on the rocks um, it would be uh, pretty hard to kind of navigate through because uh, the path is is not super clear but uh, as long as you look for the white arrows uh, you'll be able to make it through pretty good but this is the ledge it kind of pops up almost three feet and uh, we had to give it a, a try or two to to get up and we ended up uh, putting the locker in and uh, Emily didn't uh, like that so much but once we got past that big rock the rest of it you know we just kind of followed the path out and it it went pretty well Alright guys, so that was uh, the hard section of Rainbow Terrace. Uh, the rest of it as we head up to the geyser area is all basic sand roads. So uh, some pretty challenging little rock steps and uh, fortunately they have painted white lines that kind of guide you uh, through the where you need to go. So just picking the right line and the right amount of uh, uh, right foot when you need it and uh, you'll make it through. And uh, Emily did a, a decent job of getting through and uh so hope you guys enjoyed the video uh thanks for watching if you're a subscriber thanks for subscribing if you haven't subscribed yet uh please consider subscribing if you liked what you saw today uh please give us a thumbs up share it with your friends and uh this is dan sam emily and henry from fisher jeep adventures and we'll see you on the trail <laughs>